Hello YouTube, what am I doing today? Well, today I am building uh, 14P1S packs out of all of these cells that I have saved, tested, retested and made sure I have the right capacity for what I need. Now, um, to do this all I'm using is basically glue gun, soldering iron, uh, flux, solder and what left over solar tabbing wire that I have and I'm just going around all sides and back again so we have one leg there we have one leg here and I'm going to build four of these because I have enough really 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 super good cells to do this so I've got one there one here I'm going to be building the third one today. I'm going to be using these cells, which will all come from a recent skip find. And we're going to be building the third one. I'll show you how I do it. And uh, basically, I'm not, not going to spend, I'm going to do a long video on this and, and a long video on putting everything together in the case, which the case has still got to be fixed. And I've got to find uh, a certain BMS that I purchased on eBay a while back. So, pliers. I'm basically going to rip all of these off. So what I'm probably going to do is just um, start doing this on camera and either cut to the end when I've stripped all these to, for the next part or, um, or uh, just do it at high speed. But not time lapse because you don't get sound on time lapse. There we go, there we have it. 14 cells stripped of all their tabs. Next thing to do is to grind them all down and give them a nice polished or rough edge so that we can solder to these. I'm gonna do that now before I glue them all together. There we go, cleaned all the ends up, roughed them up so the solder will take. And now it's ready to find something to uh, hold them in place so I can glue them. So I've got to warm up the glue gun. Right, I found a makeshift square for this video. I can't use the one that I used for the other packs because it won't fit in with the camera pointing this way, so this will do for now. So I think what we do is we push one into the corner, get a dab of hot glue on there, stick that to that one. Okay, it's quite simple, the first ones seem to be the easiest.
there we have it. 14 cells stuck together. It has wandered off slightly. You can see on this edge, top edge here. But we're not too worried about that because we've now gone to the next stage which is tinning and soldering these. Right, just going to wet some of these with the flux. There we have it, another pack soldered, ready to be charged, just move this holding iron out of the way. Now, I don't know if you can see, but these batteries are at 3 volts, um, so I will have to charge these now, because these have all been discharged and left, ready for the main battery packs. Let's see how much power it takes uh, to charge these full. I'm just going to charge it at 4 amp power. Uh, and uh, join me in my next video, when uh, we'll uh, squeeze them into the battery box, which I haven't shown you yet and uh, make a start in uh, putting bits together. Yes, so thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe, comment and rate, and I'll see you in my next video. Cheers.